This is a monkey puzzle tree. Uh, the beginning of the nature trail is right over there. But right at the head is the famous monkey puzzle tree. It's a uh, quite a unique tree. There are the pine cones. You can see them on the ground down there too. They're very sharp. Sticky. I wouldn't run run into wow, that is sharp. Wouldn't run run into one of them in the woods at night. But uh, even their leaves are sticky. That hurt. And if I was a monkey, I sure wouldn't want to mess around in that tree. They grow quite tall. Oh, that's tall, that's all. <laughs> well, come on. Let's go down. Ah, on the way down, I found a slightly smaller monkey puzzle tree. I guess they're going to try to get a grove of them going. Quite interesting. Quite interesting. Okay. You can tell I didn't wear my hat today. I forgot it. And believe me, it's getting hot out here. Okay, here we are at the beginning of the trailhead. You can see the river it is right down there. One of their little drainage canals coming through here. Here's what I find most interesting back here. And that is the bamboo. They had bamboo planted at the entrance from the river. They use bamboo extensively for different things. Now when it's all dried out and when the wind's blowing you can hear the bigger ones knocking around like wind chimes. I don't know if we can get them to... Uh, those are not quite mature enough. my dog and I spot we used to come back here and she would go racing down the trail and hide from me she was a burger see it all around a couple kayakers down there Oh, they look like the petal types. Boy. Once it gets growing, it's hard to stop. I've had a few customers when I was in landscaping wanted me to remove bamboo from their property. And it, <laughs> you just can't do it. Every little piece that drops on the ground, roots shoot out of it. Ah, oh, here are some bigger ones up here. Quit photographing the trail and start. Now there's some knockers. When the wind's even blowing a slight breeze, which is not today, 
these can get real noisy and it's a beautiful beautiful sound it's like having bamboo wind chimes everyone in the neighborhood going off at the same time oh. Oops, I broke that one. Yep, we'll let the wind take care of that. But anyway, the breeze is not blowing today, so I guess we're not going to get a rousing trip out of the bamboo. I can hear a little bit. The wind's picking up. Our breeze came through and I could hear them clanking together. For you bicyclists, it's legal to ride your bike back here. I've done it many a time. The sign says no bicycles, but Everybody does it. Leisurely strolling down the river. Now he's using paddles and she's using a pet foot peg. I guess maybe you can run them both ways. Okay, into the bamboo. Let's see what. Can you see the ladybug? She has absolutely. Dined upon these leaves. Look at them. Some kind of a vine growing up this tree. Just little with them. Looks like somebody took a shotgun and blew it apart. And it's all the appetite is one little There she goes. nature look at the lace like pattern there must be something awful good about that leaf that they like the whole thing Yet they didn't even touch the palm. Mother Nature at work. Well, what have we here? I thought they had gotten rid of this when they built a new one. But it's still here. I've listened to many a nature talk out here. I camped here at the campground several times, mainly because it's cheap. 
senior citizens get half price. And believe me, I am a senior citizen and it is hot. <clears throat> Are you fishing or are you catching? Drowning. <laughs> sort of rickety looking, but we'll find out. This is on the trail about a quarter of the ways in. Inspiration point. Let this place be one of peace. May all who walk away from here walk away with something steps and a happy heart. And it looks like the vandals have got to that one. Okay, back to the trail. Well, that man's name is Craig, and I told him all about my YouTube adventure, and he's going to look it up tomorrow, and maybe we'll get a new subscriber to our channel. Who knows? <laughs> but anyway, I spotted another trail. It goes off to the right up here, and it's a new trail. I've never been on it before, but I was down here about a year or two ago when they were clearing a uh, over off the drive going to the historic village. They were clearing a big area out, and I got a feeling that they turned it into a prairie type deal. And so we're going to go down the uh, the new path and check it out and see if it goes by the prairie, and. Uh, I'll be right back. Doodle. Okay. Here's the new path. So we'll just walk down here for see where it goes. Maybe it'll bring me out closer to my scooter. A lot of you may think I'm crazy old man for doing this kind of stuff, but I'll tell you what. Since I've had both of my hips replaced, I feel a lot better after getting out and doing some exercise like this. And it gets me out of the house even though it's hot out here. I'm getting fairly acclimated. Gotta get rid of that habit. And, uh... When I get on the water, I get on the water, and I just do whatever I feel like doing. So, back to the path. It don't look like it's used a whole lot. Looks more like a service road. But maybe it'll be a shortcut behind the planetary house and all the historic area and we'll just wait and see where it comes out yeah, just like I thought it's coming out into this new developed area this used to be all hardwood pine trees and undergrowth and it looks like the trees are trying to make it come back. I don't know what their reasoning was for doing this. But I'm sure that they know a lot better than I do. And I thought maybe that was a monkey puzzle, but it's not. The leaves are too soft. 
probably be something poison. I'll get it all over my skin and the sweat will run it all over my hands and my hands will rot and drop off. Well, let's hope not. Oh, coming into some shade. Believe me, shade is getting easy to enjoy. Okay, we're back into the, the woodsy area, so we'll back off for now. Oops. Which way do I go? Do I want to go to the left? Or do I want to go to the right? This looks like the path most traveled, so we'll take it. And find out where it goes. Hmm. Looks like the end of the trail to me. I'm not lost. I'm just mildly disoriented, as my brother Harley used to say. So, we'll go back. Try the other way. Looks like this pathway was the uh, correct one to begin with and it leads to the dump but I see a road just on the other side so we'll go see if that's the road we need to take back to where we parked Libby at Maybe we can find another trail. Yep. I don't see any. But we'll find out where the road goes. Ah, Libby, there you are, walking around the corner, I couldn't see you, and I thought somebody had stolen you. I thought, wow, what do I do now? Because I knew I had parked her by that bench and that pathway. But she's still there. Libby, Libby girl, come here.